Hey everyone, it's Ryan here with Gilbert Fireplaces and Barbecues, and I am so excited to introduce you guys to the latest and greatest accessory from Yoder Smokers. Let me introduce the wood-fired insert. This thing just drops right in place of where the grates would be on the grill. Um, what's really neat, and you'll get to see this in action here when we get it fired up, but what's really neat about this insert is that you're gonna get the flame that rolls over the top of the, uh, the oven, and then you're gonna have that heat up the deck here. So it really does mimic a wood-fired oven with that top-down heat um, and that direct flame. So really a nice design from Yoder. The benefit to going with something like this is you don't have a separate oven um, and smoker. You have one piece that kind of does it all, which is really convenient, right? So you, you pop this in and all you have to do is turn on the smoker, right? So what you do is you go over here, we're gonna hit our power button, all right? And what you wanna do with this, now these Yoder smokers can get up over 600 degrees and you're gonna wanna set it to that 600 degree mark. So I'm gonna hit start here and it's starting to heat up, the pellets are gonna drop. Then I'm gonna crank this baby up. So let's just get this thing up as hot as we can get it. Now here's the thing, the Yoder smoker temperature uh, control is monitoring this temperature of the smoker itself. This oven's gonna get much hotter than the 600 degrees that we have the set point at for the grill, okay? The other benefit to going with something like this versus a wood-fired oven is that you don't need to constantly feed it. This will obviously also preheat a little bit quicker than the wood-fired oven. You know, typically something like this is gonna take about 30 minutes to preheat versus the hour that the wood-fired oven takes. Okay, so this Yoder wood-fired insert's been going for about five minutes now. I want you to see this. So on the side of it here, you're starting to get that flame coming up and you're gonna see that as, as the pellets keep dropping, obviously that fire is gonna get larger and it's gonna throw that flame across the top here and you're going to get the action like you're going to get on a, a standard wood burning oven. Our wood fire insert has been heating up for about 35 minutes now. This is good and hot so we're going to throw our pizza in now. We'll see how this works out here. Let me angle it in. I'm going to get eye level with it. Look at that awesome top down flame coming on this just like an actual wood fired oven. Okay, so let's check on the bottom here. Ooh, yeah, that is, I don't know if you can see that in the camera, but that is golden brown on the bottom. So the bottom's done. Now what I wanna do, so look at the top. Top's looking beautiful. I wanna get a little bit more color on top of the crust here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna hold this up inside the oven, but hold it up off the deck, because that bottom, that crust is cooked. We don't want that to go any longer. But I'm gonna hold that up here and see if we can get a little color on the outer crust. Get a lot of that top down heat just kind of giving us that. See that golden brown we're getting from that spot there? So I'm just gonna give it one more half spin. Get that other side for about 15 seconds here. We're gonna slice into this. All right, so let's take a look. Oh yeah, and that worked beautifully. We got nice coloration on that crust now. Getting those little char bubbles. Look at that, that's gorgeous. We're gonna let that sit for about a minute or so. We'll slice into that. I'll just slice this whole thing up here. And that cooked up really nice. I mean, look at that. Great bottom. See the air pockets in the crust on the side there. Nice golden brown cheese. But that being said, this pizza looks absolutely incredible. Let's take a bite. And it is incredible. That's really good. What I've noticed cooking on the Yoder insert is that the top heat and the bottom heat are almost perfect, they're, they're identical. So it cooks at the same rate. And you get a very evenly cooked pizza. Now at the end I lifted it up to get a little bit more char on the crust on the outside, which you can see we did. Awesome crunch on that crust, good crisp. Got the char, pretty awesome. All right guys, so Yoder did it again. They came out with an excellent wood-fired oven insert for their amazing pellet smokers. This pizza cooked up incredibly, guys. It was evenly cooked on the bottom, evenly cooked on the top. It took about 30 minutes to get this thing, you know, preheated here. Uh, it took about four or five minutes for the pizza to cook. Came out absolutely incredible. Guys, if you have a Yoder smoker, you gotta get down here and you gotta get one of these. It's an amazing addition. I love it, I'm fired up over it, guys. If you liked it, if you liked that video, hit that like button, subscribe to us on YouTube, and follow us on Instagram and Facebook for more barbecue tips and tricks. This is Ryan with Gilbert Fireplaces and Barbecues, where indoor comfort meets outdoor entertaining.